Are we at Brewport Brewing? Yes. In the state of Connecticut? Yes, in Bridgeport. We're very close to the P.T. Barnum Museum, which I've never been to, and I'm very ashamed. Are we going to have today's flights of fancy on a tightrope? No. Unless you mean like a tightrope of our heartstrings. Well, first off, this is a really cool place. They have a nice mural outside, and we were are moments from the highway. So if anybody is driving up I-95 and passing Bridgeport, exit 27, you could literally leap off the uh, railing. So. Sweetie. Yeah, I have What do we have here at Brew Point Brewery in Bridgeport? You have a pretty yummy looking spinach salad in a bowl as big as our mixing bowl that I put my popcorn in at home. We have, I'm sorry, I gave you back the menu and I forgot it described the beers. Oh my gosh, if that's our pizza coming, it's gigantic. He put it from light to dark, so I'm gonna be doing it the opposite way when we drink it. We have the blood orange blonde, which he says is their best seller. Then we have a summer ginger sour, crafted by their head brewer to give you a little summer in every glass. Then we have, I am so excited about this, a black IPA, they are so hard to find. It's called Rule of Two, and it is again 666. And then we have Dr. Porter's Stout. Ooh, yum. Thank you. I'm going to start with the, uh, the Blood Orange Blonde. It's definitely not an IPA type thing. It's not hoppy at all. It is a very refreshing beer, just like they say. Blood Orange Blonde at Brewport Brewing in Bridgeport, Connecticut. Sweetie. What? I know we've never talked about this kind of thing, but could we have a threesome with a... <laughs> Blood orange blonde. I think we just did. <laughs> Next, we're gonna try the ginger sour. I'm gonna smell it. Definitely smells like ginger. Oh, 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 oh. It is sour, but you can definitely taste the ginger. It's, it's sort of like almost like sour ginger ale. Summer ginger sour. Sweetie, can we have another threesome <laughs> with a summer ginger who's a little bit sour? Well, I think it would be a foursome. There you have it. <laughs> the first threesome followed by the first fourth some on beer vlog. So now we're gonna try the black IPA. It's called the Rule of Two. Do I look like I'm bristling with excitement? Ooh, baby, baby. Very nice. Let me taste it again. They talk about beers having mouthfeel. This kind of has good mouthfeel. It's not too effervescent. It's not too hoppy. It may be a little bit of coffee flavor. It's from their brewing apprentice. You must fulfill your destiny. Is that Yoda? It's delicious. Rule of two. That's the best beer I've had in a flight. Damn, that's a good second rule of two. Can we have two extra threesomes and foursomes? Now I'm going to have to enforce the rule of two in our relationship. Sorry about that, pal. It's the edge of the frame, <laughs> edge of the frame. The next one is Dr. Porter's style. It says it's old school English style. <laughs> it's very refreshing. I mean, this is why I fell in love with dark beers. Dr. Porter's style. Sweetie? What? Sweetie? Yes. Can you take me to the doctor, doctor, stout to recover from all the twosomes, threesomes, and foursomes we've had in one beer vlog? I just want all our fans to know that I enforce the rule of two. <laughs>